Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to another vlog. Out again, headed to the truck yard. I'm gonna be picking up my friend's uh, truck. I did tell you guys that I will be driving my truck, but uh, there's a couple more things that uh, I'm waiting for. My truck is ready to go. Like I told you guys, it's already ready to go. Um, I can drive it, I can start driving it, but um, there's a couple of things that I'm waiting for before I start driving that. So after this trip, after I come back from this trip, I'm gonna start driving my own truck. For now, I'm going out to Utah, South Jordan. I've never been there. It's my first time going out there. I have been to Salt Lake City, but never been to uh, South Jordan, Utah. So that's a new place for me. Uh, delivery is for Monday and today is Saturday. So I'm not gonna drive all the way to Utah today. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drive a couple of miles uh, up to Reno or past Reno and I'll take a break over there and then tomorrow morning, the next morning, I'm gonna start um, driving all the way to Utah. But like I said, today is Saturday and my delivery is on Monday. And the total miles for for Utah, where uh, for South Jordan, Utah, uh, I believe it's 700 miles. So I'm not going to be putting all those 700 miles today. So I might just put some today and then some tomorrow. So not sure how many miles I'll be putting in today, but uh, let's see. I mean, I'll, I will drive until midnight and then uh, take a break and then. Next morning, I'm gonna drive all the way to um, Utah, South Jordan, Utah, where my delivery is on Monday at 7 a.m. I already picked up the load yesterday. I didn't, I didn't make a vlog for that. I went to Fairfield, and that's where I picked up the load from. It's like a empty soda cans that I'm delivering up to uh, South Jordan, Utah. The price was pretty good. I bought Texas, which is, I believe, 900 miles from uh, South Jordan, Utah. So I'll be passing a couple of states. Uh, I'm not sure which way I'm going to be going, but just took out the truck, parked the car, and I'm out. So it's about 10 hour and 3 minutes of drive and it's almost like 700 miles. So it's taking me from uh, obviously 5 and then, well this thing is going from 99 but I'm not going to be taking that. I'm going to be taking 5 all the way to 80 and then 80 is going to go all the way uh past soda springs donner pass Truckee, and here comes the nevada so i might stop somewhere in reno this is reno right here so i might stop if i get tired i might stop here or i might keep on going and there's another town uh that comes Right here, Love Love Lock. I might stop over there. There's another uh, truck stop over there, so I might stop. But let's see uh, how long I'm going to be driving for. Right now, it is, I believe, it's uh, 3 p.m. or 4 p.m. So I'm going to start driving now, and then, like I said, it's a 10 hour and three minutes of drive. So. I'm not going to complete the whole thing today. I'm going to leave some for tomorrow and then go straight to South Jordan. And this is where my delivery is going to be. This is a warehouse. This is where my delivery is going to be at PRC warehouse. Um, 
which is right off of Highway Highway 111 in South Utah. Um, as you guys know, this is where I bought my truck from too, my semi truck. I bought it from my Utah. Anyways, I'm gonna make my logbook. I already put in the address. I'm gonna make my logbook and start driving towards um, Utah and see where I stop. And I might stop in Reno, like I said, or uh, maybe past Reno. I just reached the Sacramento downtown and I'm gonna be taking 80 towards Reno, which is gonna come in a few minutes. I'm gonna get on that and that's gonna take me straight all the way to Utah. I don't usually go go up there like in the winter time, only like in summertime if I find a good rate. So I, I go up there. Otherwise, I stay like towards Texas and all those areas down south. <laughs> This is the area, this is like the top of the mountain area, this lake in summertime it gets all, I mean uh, winter time, it's all frozen and this area it's all covered with snow and the temperature sometimes drops down to like negative. It happened to me once and what happens is all these bridges that you see it gets all icy like all the all the snow like you know because of the freezing temperature and it makes it all slip, slippery there's a, like a steep downhill coming up uh not right now this is a downhill too but um but a steep downhill at that for new drivers, I don't recommend coming towards this area in winter time. Because I to go to the Chana, I have to go to the Palace, I have to go to the Palace, I have to go to the California law. Jesse, like, I have to go to the Taro, I have to go to the Sikna, 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 I have to go to the the Chino wala kya naam hai wo gatta gatta sa mein jata hole se like aapan jate it damages the road basically if every saal ye naya banate hain road but I might have a video I might have an old video uh, of this place uh, covered with snow so I will post that on the blog too just to show you guys what it, what this place looks like in winter time but. like going down the hill and going uphill is not a problem going downhill is a problem and if you're a new driver you know and you don't know like how how fast you're supposed to go down you can like jackknife the truck and you know many jump license liya uh many liya tha us waqt sab time tha so isi isi jagah pe maine bhi chalaya tha but summertime, so, I was like, I'm going to go to the license. I'm going to go to the license. I'm going to go to the 
स्टोव में चलाना शुरू किया क्योंकि उस वक्त मेरा हाथ बैठ गया था लाइक यू नो आई गाइ यूज टू ट्रक एंड आई नो लाइक यू नो हाउ फास्ट टू गो डाउन और हाउ स्लो टू गो डाउन और यू नो हाउ टू फुल ऑन चेंज ऑल दैट स्टफ वो सारा मैंने सीख के तब मैं फिर स्नो में चलाना शुरू किया एक बार लाइक मेरे को पक्का हो गया कि लाइक यू नो मैं भी रेडी हूँ स्नो में जाने के लिए स्नो में जाना लाइक इट्स इट्स गुड टू हैव एक्सपीरियंस यू नो ड्राइविंग इन स्नो दैट वे यू नो इफ यू हैव टू गो समेर इन इमरजेंसी यू विल नो हाउ टू डू दैट बट वो द ट्रैक्टर ट्रेलर इट्स नॉट लाइक अ कार सो स्पेशली फॉर आप आप चलिंग दिस टू दोज न्यू ड्राइवर्स आप जितने भी नए ड्राइवर हैं उनको मैं बता रहा हूँ भाई ट्रैक्टर ट्रेलर जो है ना वो गाड़ी की तरह नहीं है कि आप समझो कि भाई आप इसको कितनी भी रफ्तार से नीचे उतार सकते हो नो 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 डू नाट मेक दैट मिस्टेक बिकॉज अगर ये लूज हो गया तो इसको रोकना ना तो ये पीछे जो है ना ट्रेलर इसके अंदर होता है अब आप थाउजेंड ऑफ पाउंड अब डो तो ये देखो ये ये आ रहा है डाउन हिल आ रहा है ये ये स्टीप ये सबसे स्टीप वाला डाउन हिल है तो मैं तो यूज टू हूँ मैं तो लाइक खींच के निकल जाता हूँ लाइक उतार देता हूँ लेकिन सब विंटर टाइम में मैं बहुत लाइक स्लो यहाँ से इस एरिया से ना मैं बहुत स्लो जाता हूँ बिकॉज यहाँ पर जो है ना ब्लैक आइस बहुत होती है ये देखो सारा खुला एरिया है यहाँ पर विंटर टाइम में बहुत विंड भी चलती है यहाँ पर काफ़ी एक्सीडेंट्स वगैरह भी हुए हैं तो जो मैंने खुद भी देखे हैं एनी वो इज लाइक यू नो फॉर दो न्यू ड्राइवर्स तो आप लोगों को बता दो भाई कि क्या नाम अगर आप इस एरिया में नहीं आए हो और आप नए हो विंटर टाइम में आ रहे हो जस्ट यू नो हैव समाइक एक्सपीरियंस विद यू हैव लाइक experience driver with you do not come alone unless you have driven a truck before in the snow then it's good but if you you have it then i would recommend it no maine kafi dekha hai jitne bhi zyada jitne bhi accident yahan par hue hain na maine dekha wo zyada naye jo truckers naye jo bachche le rahe the license liya na unhone unhone zyada accidents kiya yahan par kya hota hai down to chale jate hain speed पकड़ के फिर जब रोकने की बारी आती है तो रुकता नहीं है ट्रैक तो ऑब्वियसली फिर क्या नाम है कहीं ठोकर क्या नाम है क्रैश करना पड़ता है आपको फॉर देयर सेफ्टी बट एनी ये है एटी हाईवे एटी है ये जो जाता है ऑल द वे टू दिस गोज ऑल द वे टू लाइक यू टाइम फॉर द डिलीवरी फॉर दो लाइक टू स्नो बोर्ड एंड स्केटिंग This is the area in Soda Springs. यहाँ पर ये रेस्टेडिया भी आता है और रेस्टेडिया से पहले ये आता है ये जगह है यहाँ पर सारा ये देख रहे हो सामने पहाड़ उस पर सारा स्नो होता है तो यहाँ पर स्केटिंग वगैरह स्नो बोर्डिंग एवरीथिंग यहाँ पर लोग आते हैं मसला खाली यहाँ पर ये है कि यहाँ पर खाली दो रिजॉर्ट है एक ये सामने और एक वो पीछे था और ये दोनों रिजोर्ट जो है फिर फुल हो जाते हैं विंटर टाइम में तो ये जो है पीक है और दूसरी की बात ये जो बेस्ट एरिया है यहाँ पर ये पूरा ठक जाता है स्नो से लाइक यू सी दॉल वर्ल्ड ब्लू इज इट्स लाइक कवर्ड अप टू दैट अप टू देर ये देखो इन्होंने ये लाइक पोल भी लगाया हुआ है जहाँ तक स्नो जाता है वो देखो और अच्छा So it gets like this um, rest area gets all covered with snow, and this is the steep downhill that I was talking about. This is a six percent downhill. We have about, I'll say it's about like ten miles, almost ten miles or something. But uh, yeah. यहाँ पर जो है बहुत भी केयरफुल रहना पड़ता है वेन गोइंग डाउन बिकॉज अगर आप फुली लोडेड हो दैन आपका ट्रक जो है ना एकदम फ्री हो सकता है क्या नाम है स्पीड पकड़ सकता है दैन इट गेट्स रियली डेंजरस हियर सो दिस इज द वर्स्ट प्लेस एंड वेंटर टाइम एनी वेज 
ये रास्ता है इससे आगे आएगा ये जैसे आप हिल उतरोगे उतरोगे इससे आगे आएगा एक छोटा सा टाउन उसका नाम है ट्रकी ट्रकी जो है लास्ट टाउन है अब कैलिफोर्निया और उसके बाद उससे आगे आ जाता है उसका बॉर्डर नवारा का बॉर्डर आ जाता है ट्रकी के बाद में तो ऑन माय डे सो ये एरिया जो है ना बड़ा खूबसूरत लगता है लाइक इन विंटर टाइम सारा ये जितना भी आप ग्रीन देख रहे हो ये सारा एरिया स्नो से भरा होता है ओके हियर कम्स द ट्रकी कैलिफोर्निया द लास्ट टाउन ऑफ कैलिफोर्निया इसके बाद आगे जाके ये जैसे ये जो मर जा रहा है जाके आगे इसके बाद आ जाएगा बोर्डर इंस्पेक्शन स्टेशन आ जाएगा आगे गाइस हियर कम्स द बोर्डर सी दैट ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड दैट्स इंस्पेक्शन स्टेशन एबल टू एंटर कैलिफोर्निया यू गो थ्रू थ्रू देयर यहाँ पर सारे ऑफिसर्स वगैरह होते हैं रेंजर्स and that's the truck scale right there oh some truck scale hai abhi meri side pe bhi aayega yahan par aage ja ke right side pe mera bhi inspection station aayega but i believe it's going to be closed at this time so this is the uh, truck the wait station and uh, that's to enter california okay, so here comes the inspection station but i think it's closed so i have to go in just going to bypass it cuz it says when flashing check station arrow but the light flash over the tabhi andar aana hai check station ke otherwise i don't have to but anyways i just pass this uh check station and now we know from here is about like less than 45 minutes 20 minutes Here comes the Reno City of Gamblers. There's all type of casinos here, the GSR and uh I don't know, there's like a lot of them. There's a lot of casinos here in this Reno Nevada. there's GSR nugget and like so many other casino circus circus uh I've been to this one the circus circus and there's another one called nugget which is going to come up there I've also been to that one it's a nice uh hotel resort casino so I'll show you guys. That's a GSR back there. That white building. I believe that's the biggest casino here in Nevada, Reno, Nevada. But uh I'm not sure though. And this is Nugget right here. This is the one I I've, I've stayed at. This one and then there's another one, third one that I've stayed at. Uh but I like this better than the GSR but kind of like this one better. Yeah, but functions over there be hote hain ka ke na my life functions over there hote hain music and everything. So it looks pretty cool, the view is pretty nice and uh it's not much traffic here. The GSR us mein zyada traffic hota hai like kafi log hote hain. I think like I said I think it's the biggest one in Reno that's the biggest hotel in Reno but I'm not I'm not exactly sure about that so this is another city uh called Sparks Nevada and this is the mall of Sparks I don't know if they have one in Reno too but all I know is that this is the one I'm pretty sure that they, they got one too in Reno but this is the one that I know of So I stopped here in Fairly, Nevada. I believe that's what this town is called. Uh, I'm gonna get some stuff from here from Walmart. Park my truck right there. 
And um, since I told you guys I have a long way to go after Utah, I'm going to Texas. So I'm not trying to just, like stop everywhere. So I'm gonna get some stuff from here, beverage and some frozen stuff. So I got my stuff from Walmart and I'm back on the road. My phone died so I couldn't record the whole thing uh, coming out of Walmart. I couldn't record that part because my phone died, but uh, I have about seven hours of drive now. So I'm probably gonna drive like one or two more hour. And there's a pilot coming up uh, in Love Lock or past Love Lock. I'm gonna stop over there, rest, and then in the morning, I'm gonna get up and start driving. Uh, I'll show you guys what I got um, from Walmart. Uh, basically, I just got like some yogurt, milk, cookies, snacks, and you know, other stuff. Uh, grapes and stuff like that so uh, but anyways like I said seven hours of drive uh, I'm probably gonna drive like two more hours and then stop stop somewhere uh, rest most likely at, at a truck stop and then from there I'm gonna go straight to South Jordan tomorrow since I have delivery on Monday, early morning, 7 a.m. So. so I got here in Mill City. This is a pilot uh, truck stop here. Um, it is 12 a.m. Uh, midnight and I'm super tired. So I'm gonna rest here, wake up tomorrow take a shower, do my breakfast, and I'll be back on the road after that. For tonight, this is it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Presented by MK Studio.